Hope you enjoyed the uh, taste of fall. It is going to get warmer and it is going to get uh, more humid, but surely we'll get these fronts that are going to become more frequent and uh, will bring us, you know, more uh, cooler and cooler weather as uh, the uh, weeks and months uh, go by. So let's talk about that and check in uh, with uh, meteorologist Cindy Pressler. She is going to let us know how this fall is shaping up. Here in South Florida, we basically have two seasons, the rainy season and the dry season. During the wet season, it rains just about every day. As a matter of fact, about 70% of our total rainfall during the year occurs during the rainy season. A dry day is quite uncommon. We'd like to see a little dry day. Now it's hurricane season, so occasionally you get the Saharan dust in here and that'll give us a dry day, but overall, it's very wet. Okay, now we move into the middle part of October. October 15th, the dry season kicks in. What does that look like? Of course, lower humidity. It's dry out there. It's hurricane season, of course, and you get the rain from that, but you need to have a little bit more rain. So we get these frontal systems that come in their cold fronts. They'll supply us with showers and thunderstorms. The problem is behind these frontal systems, that's dry air. That sweeps in, and that can really dry things out, and that can lead to a very bad wildfire season. So how are we doing so far this year? Great. We've had a lot of rain during the rainy season, almost 46 inches as a matter of fact. So we're doing great. Moving into the wintertime months, we can relax, enjoy, and have a beautiful winter here in South Florida. That really breaks it all yeah. down. Thanks to our next weather team for that.